Okay, first is Jaden Animations. Dang, this looks so basic. What is that shirt? Where'd she get it from? Target? Okay, well, we're gonna yassify her real quick. First, let's draw her pose, and then her face. Okay, so her main thing is this huge poof of hair, right? Guys, you can tell Jaden is millennial because she has that millennial side part. I'm gonna make her hair as big and poofy as possible. And of course, the ahoga. Wait a second, guys. This is what Jaden looks like in real life? Wow. Mommy? Wow, I didn't know she was a goth mommy. Ooh la la. Look at those tattoos. That will be a pain in the butt to draw later on. So I'm gonna add the tattoos over here. Just a little placeholder so we remember to draw it later. And then of course, the piercings. So anyway, let's do the face. And then basically to make the hair more polished, we're gonna curve it a little bit like this. Alright, so far so good. Now we're gonna color the whole thing like this. Okay, now she looks like tentacruel. I'm gonna start adding the base colors using this lasso fill tool. Bro, I hate that basic violet shirt she's wearing. She looks like a soccer mom, so I made her more edgy with this turtleneck plus jacket. Oh, also, apparently, she apparently also has a VTuber avatar, so I used it as inspo for her shirt. Okay, I'm gonna add the makeup now. Like, obviously, we don't know her actual eye color, because her eyes are literally just two dots, so violet it is. And to the people who say, No, that's purple, not violet. I do not care, I am colorblind. So, um, as you can see, she has big spiky hair over here. The easiest way to render this is to use the banana method. Let me demonstrate. So, like a banana, like so. I the middle part with a lighter color so like another banana and then repeat steps another one all right and then use a round brush to create shadows like so and then basically just add smaller spikes also since i'm working with the cool colors i'm gonna use blue to add a strong light like this on the right look at that dinosaur very cool let's add really thick lashes really ties the whole edgy thing together okay she looks cross-eyed let's just change the eye real quick and just airbrush the iris Ooh la la okay all that's left is to render the hair with this flat brush. All right, now let's work on the body. So let me just trace her logo and then warp it on her clothes. Let's add the earrings real quick. Oh, and how did I allow this to happen? Look at how crusty the lips are. Now, Jaden may have non-existent lips, but not on my watch. It's my job to make sure she gets all the lip fillers she needs. So let's just add the highlight over here. Now I'm gonna add a necklace and then add a bird whistle because apparently she's obsessed with the birds. So I don't want this to be a white background since she looks badass here. Let's add some badly drawn blue flames. Yes, it's badly drawn, but it's part of the charm. Okay, lastly, we're gonna do the tattoo real quick. Oh my gosh, I am messing this up. Ooh, here we go. I finished drawing it. I am such a pro. I totally did not use an image of her tattoo because I was too lazy. Okay, now let's do the other one. Just pretend you're not seeing this right now. Right. I liked how this turned out before. Non-existent lips, dot eyes, and after. Juicy lips, thick and luscious lashes, very healthy and voluminous hair. Jeez, it's like I'm describing a prized horse. Well, anyway, she looks like her personality did a whole 180, but I like this. She still looks ooh la la. Overall, I really liked how this turned out. I basically turned her into like an emo Winx villain, which is a nice contrast against her shyness. I just made her inner mommy come out, especially since I saw a lot of tattoos on her. But good luck animating that though. 9 out of 10. Next, odd ones out. Now, I don't know how I'm gonna yesify this, y'all. This is literally just a naked bald guy. How am I gonna work with that? Okay, so let's look at James over here. He has a full head of hair, which is a good sign. So I'm gonna draw him winking and smiling. Because you know what, guys? I draw happy characters too. I don't just draw edgy characters, contrary to popular belief. Anyway, instead of making him butt naked, I'm gonna give him a white suit. I don't wanna get demonetized. And then a tie. It's just a nice contrast against his bubbliness. So let's start coloring now. So I'm gonna make him blonde, since James is blonde. Okay, so far this does not look like the odd ones out. It just looks like human Spongebob. But anyway, let's add the shadows real quick on the face. When you're doing this type of lighting, there's always going to be a triangle on the cheeks like this. And then let's shade the hair. Okay, why are his lips so thin? He's American, not British. So let me just fix the lips real quick. Mm, juicy. Add the canines. Right, right. So anyway, I didn't really know what to do with the hair. I'm literally just kind of copying his real life hair. But anyway, let's just render his suit real quick. I'm gonna add a little clip on his tie and then a bandage over here. And um, some stars. I don't know. His persona just reminds me of the Takashi Murakami flower. So yeah, we're gonna airbrush a yellow color to emphasize the happiness 
happiness. Also, let's add a peace sign. Okay, guys, this just looks like a random guy. Something's missing. Like, I need to add something that people know is part of his character, but I don't know what. Ooh, I know. All right, 10 out of 10. So this time, instead of turning him into the badass persona, like how I did with Jaden, I just made him kind of bubbly. And I get that that's not his character at all, but it would be a nice contrast against his sarcastic humor. I rate this 3 out of 10. I could not yassify a naked bald guy. Okay, last one, Domix. Guys, why do they all look the same? They all have dots for eyes. And they have really crappy fashion sense too. Like, where is the drip? This is just a hoodie from Target. Okay, I shouldn't be the one to judge because my avatar just looks like this anyway okay guys this is domix in real life first off how did he get his hair to go up like that like you'd think i would make fun of him for being emo right but i'm just impressed how did he do that wow bro what hair gel do you use anyway i'm gonna base his hair on that anime ass hair okay all right cool so far so good so let's just color again I'm gonna add a light like this on the right. The hair is a little bit tricky. It's a bit yellowish on the right because of the lighting, but on the left, we're just gonna shade it like normal. Okay, so I'm also gonna add a bubblegum like here, over here, just so he's doing something with his lip. Okay, okay, this is him so far. Eh, it's pretty alright. But now, we're gonna fix his drip, okay? Because like, what the heck is that? You can't just wear a hoodie and go on with your day. That's how you get bullied by the international Asian kids. So I'm gonna give him a bag. So so this is distress. Actually, let's add his name over here. Okay, what am I doing? This is gonna get him bullied even more. But it's cool. So whatever. Okay, then over here, let's add a line and then a cute little panda bear. Pookie wookie. Now let's give him some AirPods so he doesn't have to listen to your bullshit. And let's see, some glasses. All right. Now he looks like a generic manhua protagonist. So he kind of ended up as a generic anime protagonist. But like, isn't that what Domix is all about? So I basically just upgraded his wardrobe and gave him more accessories. Although I should have made him nerdier than this. I don't know what I was thinking. 6 out of 10. I may have yassified him, but his drip is unmatchable. Okay, so here are the final drawings. Personally, I liked Jaden's revamp version the most. I mean, you can clearly tell, right? But anyway, I would say that I had the hardest time with the Odd Ones Out's avatar because he was essentially just a marshmallow with eyes, okay? Let me know your thoughts. Also, guys, I do not want to be seeing comments going like, But they look nothing like them! I'm not drawing them. I'm just the yassified their avatars bro if you don't like that go cry about it also no hate at all to them they cool have anyway hope you guys like this video watch this next one i'll see you there stay cool